Bunny Loves, welcome back to my channel. As y'all can see, I am here with another wig review. This hair is from ebonylot.com. Stay tuned, I do have another wig just like this one. But if you guys would like to know more about this wig, just keep on watching. Okay, y'all, let's go ahead and jump right into it. Today we have Altre's Lace Front in the style Haley, and I have it in the color 2T425. So this is what it looks like on the model here. So pretty. I love, what attracted me to this wig is of course the color. As y'all can see, I am on this little red burgundy trim because y'all gotta get ready, the fall time is coming up fall winter and y'all know these dark neutral colors they're, they're making their way back okay what this wig is is a six inch swiss lace deep parting wig and it says down here it has a jagged edge cut so the back of the wig is going to go pretty much like a v shape in the back because i was supposed to be getting the same wig from a another company but they were out of stock so i also have another wig because that's pretty much like this wig but in another style so give me a second if the company that you're searching for this wig for runs out of stock of Haley wig y'all we have soraya 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 in the same color she pretty much looks the same also jagged edge cut and as well as the different colors down here as well so if you guys were afraid of color it does have those regular colors like one one to be two four so on and so forth but today since this video is sponsored by ebony line i will be reviewing the Haley wig and i will show you guys what that one looks like on so i'm just going to go ahead and take this wig off as always, if you guys want to know the details on this hair, check out the cards above. I do have a video on this hair. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and take this out. So as y'all can see, this is what this week looks like on. It is really, really wavy and the color it goes from a burgundy to a like a red wine color at the bottom if you guys can see it's more like a like an ombre color it's subtle it's not too bright or not bright at all and this is what it looks like around the lace and the parting will also be plucked because again, this parting is way too skinny and doesn't look realistic at all. The luster of it, it does look really shiny. So I'm just going to go ahead and cut the lace off and start styling the wig. And then we'll continue to talk about the specs of this wig.
guys this is what I got with the hair so far the wig is big head friendly for those of you who do ask me that question also the parting I did pluck it a little bit and just put a little bit of powder in it let me put a little bit more but I also want to state that this wig did not come with a lot of parting space around the perimeter as y'all can see it did not give me pretty much anything but i just went ahead and made baby hair anyway and now i'm just putting a little bit of powder right here but other than that what i did was brush the hair out and y'all saw how it got a little poofy and everything but the feeling of it brushed out was really I didn't like the feeling of it it felt very dry and I just didn't like it so what I did to get the curls or waves back was just spray it with water so in this container it's just water and I just blue dry it on cool and the curls came right back and it looks like a little beach wave so this is what the hair looks like I feel like the older this hair gets the more natural it's going to look this wig also comes with two cones near the parting space so it's on basically the temples of my head and there's a comb in the back and two adjustable straps but again if you guys wanted a duplicate of this wig our tray does have another wig that looks almost exactly like this in the style Soraya Soraya I will link that down below again this hair is from ebonyline.com I feel like this hair look really pretty in like two little twists actually let me go ahead and do that now So as y'all can see, this is a hairstyle you all can do for this wig. This is also how you can wear your hair at night if you want to just tie it up, put it in a bonnet, just wrap these two around like this and then put it up or you can make this a hairstyle as well. But this is a great way to sleep with your wigs if you wanted to sleep with like a wavy texture and then in the morning when you're ready to go just take off the bands and unravel the hair then you're pretty much set to leave out the door after that because the waves are still intact there are no tangles or anything it's the wig that you just throw on or that you leave on twisted up shake and go and the older it gets the better it'll look because it is very lightweight it's super flat to your head so of course your foundation is going to be flat well it needs to be flat for this wig to look good other than that you guys will not have to do pretty much anything to this wig <laughs> Okay, so this is the Soraya wig. This hair has a little bit more bump in the front, as y'all can see. This is pretty much the exact same wig. This wig, I would not say this wig is big head friendly. This wig is a bit more soft than the Haley wig. And I like how this one has a little bit more bump to it. The parting is skinny, just like the Haley wig. It's actually less wavy then the Haley wig this is more of a loose wave both wigs are hot tool friendly up to 400 degrees so comparing these two side by side i would choose the Haley wig okay so now i have the Haley wig back on and again this one is more big head friendly than the soraya wig and it is longer I feel like you can play around with this hair a little bit more. Tell me what y'all think about the two wigs. Which wig would you choose? Would you choose the Haley wig or would you choose Soraya? Y'all let me know in the comment section down below. The Haley wig 
is from ebonyline.com and the Soraya wig was from blackhairspray.com but you can find both wigs on both websites but I will link each wig that I got these two from down below in the description box so y'all check the description box out I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys on the next video bye